think we're doing two more songs. <coughs> and uh, I want to be sure and say miigwech to the ladies for uh, doing this today um, and for everyone for listening uh, to us so kindly. Uh-uh. Really? The CDs are here. Look at that. Woohoo! <laughs> Jackson, do you want to wanna hand them out? Or? This is my husband, by the way. He keeps us fed and uh, makes sure that we uh, have time to do our singing and he watches the kids sometimes. Can we give him a round of applause, please? <laughs> And apparently he delivers CDs as well. <coughs> he makes magic happen. Um, so uh, on the on the CD, you'll hear uh, that last song had a trickier part to it, but we had to stick to what we knew. So, um, but you'll hear there's a little magic part in there, and some of, uh, some of the other songs. We just hand them up. Yep. Yeah. 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 So um, this song we wanted to revitalize um, because of you know, the really important work that people are doing in our communities around um, sobriety. And we know that uh, there are people who are um, still struggling, and maybe a song can help. Um, myself, uh, uh, I've been sober for 27 years, and I know that it helps me to uh, sing and ask for help. Uh, and, and so um, this, when I saw this song in the collection, uh, it was recorded by Kimmy Wan, um, which was another very uh, prolific singer in this collection. Um, and I know that in another uh, collection of recordings that was made in 1988, they borrowed one of his songs, um, and then I think it was the Panima Singers did it as a women's dance song. So like they changed it, his dream song into a, a women's dance song. And so that's kind of what um, made me think, well, maybe we could do our best with this one. So um, we'll do our best with this one. <laughs> <laughs>
because he sang it really low, and that's how it's stuck in our minds now. 